So you know how six days ago I have made the, the, what happened to the Nintendo Directs video where I basically talk about how much, uh, in my opinion, that the Nintendo Directs have just been just, I guess, not not much Nintendo Directs have been showing and whatnot and how much, like, I guess, lackluster they are. Well, Nintendo decided to drop a bombshell and apparently we're getting into Direct tomorrow, which is pretty exciting to say, to say the least comes out um 7 a.m pacific time or 10 a.m eastern Standard time from where i am and they're going to show a 40 minute presentation regarding stuff coming to the nintendo switch and i am pretty stoked about this honestly i've i saw this uh this morning when i uh when i was at school and i was pretty hyped about this and though it's going to be on a school day for me I'm probably going to uh, still make a reaction regarding to it. I probably just won't um, be like give my first reaction to that. Pro since since there's gonna be a lot of spoilers and whatnot coming out. Uh, oh, sorry about that, by the way. Um, but uh, regarding like there's gonna be a lot of like spoilers of of people reacting to it. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna get spoiled easily. So I think what what I might do is I'll watch it when it gets if I have, if I have time. Uh, from school if i have time i can probably watch it real fast and i'll give my and then i'll give my reaction to it just overall what i think about the direct once i once i come home so that's basically i thought it was going to come out i thought it said 7 p.m is in time but it comes out 10 a.m tomorrow like so mad early which kind of sucks like i said for me since i have school but it's all good honestly but but regardless, I'm really excited about it. Um, cool that we're getting a, a Nintendo Direct and whatnot. Now the question is, what will we be getting in this Direct? Will we be getting some stuff regarding the movie, as you see at the bottom? Will we be getting stuff regarding Mario and all that stuff? Um, we're going to talk about it real fast. And I'm just going to get my full thoughts on what I think might be in this Direct. So there's a couple of things that are coming out on Switch, as well as just games in general that are coming out that possibly could make this what their way onto the Switch. Um, they're probably, I'm thinking lean towards, probably they might talk about the Breath of the Wild 2 a little bit, as that game is, I think it's still in development, and I think they delayed it until like, I think either this year or next year, in 2022 or three. But I'm pretty sure they will talk about a little bit of Breath of the Wild, Breath of the Wild, um, was it uh, Breath of the Wild Two? Because Breath of the Wild Two is popular, honestly. It's a lot of people really want to get the game. The original Breath of the Breath of the Wild is successfully good, and the fact that we they come out with a second one and no one, and they have talked about it a lot, uh, for a little bit is crazy. So I think they'll probably talk about just a little bit. I'm pretty sure also regarding like maybe like Pokemon because I think there's a Pokemon game coming out. I think it was Pokemon Scar Scar or. Pokemon Violet or something like that. I, bro, I not I don't like know Pokemon that much, but I do. I did hear about a Pokemon game coming out soon, so they'll probably talk about that. And probably the biggest thing, Mario, obviously, since Mario is Nintendo's big selling point. And they'll probably talk about life a lot of things. I think they will talk a little bit about the movie as the as not only a it's it's honestly trending right now. But B, you can kind of see a little bit from the trailer. It says "Watch it here," and it has like a little video camera. I don't think that's a teaser, but I, I feel I feel like that could, I wouldn't say hints, but maybe it kind of give us a kind of a clue that maybe they might talk about the movie somehow, or maybe they might just do like a sort of direct sort of way where they kind of talk about maybe the the making of it, or maybe somehow something related to it. Regardless, I think they will talk about very little about the movie. As a couple of days ago, we got the, or a couple of months ago, actually, in, in the other direct, they talked about the casting of who is going to be casting the, the 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 modern movie and whatnot. So I'm pretty sure they will talk about just very little about it. Probably not too much, as I think it comes out in the holiday of this year. But I think, from what I heard, it's going to be extended to next year, I think. But uh, um, they're probably going to talk about it. They might talk about probably extending it. The extended movie, and I, honestly, I respect that if they do, since this is like a huge selling point on Nintendo and Illumination as they they're working together to make the movie. 
So I, that'll be really, really cool. Um, what else do I want to talk about? Uh, I'm th- I was thinking probably they might do maybe like a Super Mario Party or Mario Party Superstar DLC. A lot of people really want that, and myself included. I have like a cool like Discord with a bunch of people that they say like they want Mario Party Superstar DLC. I've always wanted it because the fact that it's successfully doing good is crazy, and the fact I feel like they 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 could do a DLC based around it. But I feel like n- nowadays, I feel like they wouldn't now because I just feel like I don't know. They could have. I feel like they could have done it earlier if they if they want to. So, will we get a Mario Party Superstar DLC? I think I I it's fifty fifty honestly. We could we could get it maybe not. But if I if we don't get anything regarding Superstars, then it's cool honestly because like I said they could have a chance to do it, but they didn't. So why would they do it kind of now? But who knows, maybe they will. And they did with Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. We were expecting Mario Kart 9, and we got DLC for 8 Deluxe, 8 Deluxe so it makes more sense. So maybe, but who knows? Uh, reg- uh, regardless, um, what else I want to talk about? Um, I know there's Fall Guys stuff regarding that. Um, there's a uh, new season coming out on Thursday. And I'm pretty sure they'll pro- talk talk about it a little bit because I think they released a trailer a couple uh, uh I think like a couple of hours ago. I'm definitely gonna re- I'm thinking of reacting to it maybe. And it it looks pretty cool honestly, for it being the trailer. It's really exciting that uh we uh, Fall Guys getting a new season and whatnot. Pretty sure I I wouldn't be surprised if we do get sort of like a DLC or not DLC but like a talk about like a new season and whatnot. Uh, what else? Um, I heard apparently that they're making another Nickelodeon like racing car game. I forgot what it's called. I think it's called like Nickelodeon like it's a it's a racing game or some kind. I'll probably put an image of what of what I'm talking about. But they're making a third like Nickelodeon like game since I think the first two are on the Switch, so it makes sense for that game for the third one to come on come out on the Switch. And it makes some and it makes sense if they do if they don't talk about it or if they. If they somehow don't like at least like mention it, I'm gonna be kind of surprised. But who knows? Maybe they might not. Maybe they do. Who knows? Uh, other than that, um, Smash. Not re- honestly, I don't think they're not gonna talk about Smash anymore. As ever since Sora uh, got released, they haven't talked about anything regarding Smash. So I don't think they're gonna talk about that. A lot of people, from what I heard, I think they appear. People want to see Tomodachi Life come to Switch, and I played Tomodachi Life on the 3DS, and it was hell of fun. If anything, so if we get that on a Switch, that would be really exciting because Metopia, or I think yeah, Metopia was on Switch, and that was on, and that was on the 3DS, and uh, people people played it, and if we get Tomodachi Life on the Switch, that would be really cool because, like I said, I've. I like Tomodachi Life. I played it on 3DS, and I it was really cool. Kind of like this, kind of like the um, a Sims, a Sims in a way, kind of. Of uh, regarding that, um, I think that's all about it for now. I can't think of anything else. Maybe they might talk about Marker E Deluxe. Maybe I, I I don't think so honestly because I think the DLC came out uh like a couple like a month ago so I don't think they will. Maybe they might tease something about it, but I maybe maybe they will. Honestly, if they do that, that would be that would be kind of a surprise, but at the same time, not really since I f- I feel like it's like again fifty fifty. They could they could not. Uh, I also they also I'm also thinking they might do maybe like another maybe like um I, know, I can see them because you know how they have the NES entertainment system and the NES or the SNES entertainment system on Switch maybe they could do like more like expansion expansion stuff maybe they might add more stuff to Nintendo 64 as uh, the N64 expansion pack is doing well so maybe they might add a couple of games here and there. So that'll be interesting if they do. Um, I th- think, I 
think that's about it, honestly. I I seriously don't remember. I don't oh, like what else they could they could uh, do for this direct. Regardless, honestly, I'm really excited about this direct. It, it looks so it I'll, just by this alone gets me hot, gets me all hyped up, and I'm really excited just to see what Nintendo has up their sleeves for this direct. And it's 40 minutes, so you know this direct is going to be a, a, a lot. Who knows, they might even, honestly, just for fun's sake, watch this entire direct. It's going to be all about Fire Emblem. That will be just funny. <laughs> Regardless, um, that's basically it. That, that was my uh, thoughts regarding what I think is going to be in this direct. Let me know your thoughts of what else is going to be in this direct. And like I said, I uh, might be able to um, react to it once it comes out or once it's live because school. But I think, like I said, what I might do is I'm going to watch it off camera or when I, if I have like lunch at school or if I have like a, if I'm free at school, I can just watch it by myself. And then I'll, and then once I come home, I'll uh, get my, my reactions toward it and my thoughts regarding it. So, yeah. So that's basically it, guys. That was uh, my thoughts regarding the direct. Uh, let me know your thoughts on what you think it's going to be in this direct. Other than that, if y'all like this, make sure to like and subscribe. And I will see y'all next time. Peace.